Here it is. Can you get the gold on my car? Yeah. To have been acknowledged by Fortune magazine is, Excellent. it's an honor. Okay. The gold one goes with these. Okay. So how many hats is it? Um, at least nine. I'm just a dreamer, really, you know, person that always is dreaming of uh, filling voids. And then sometimes the void filling can turn into commerce, and sometimes they're wacky, obscure little concepts that I geek off of. That is sick. Fashion and technology are not even talking to each other right now. So I fit in the middle of that relationship to find the commonality between the two and come up with ideas to fuse the differences. Now for my next number, I like to turn to the classics. Kids don't even aspire, they don't even aspire to be technicians or mathematicians or engineers or scientists. So then I come in and I fit in between pop culture and technology to remind these young kids, yo, you should take an interest in STEM. Not because I'm a scientist, because I see the void to fill. You wanna give me a cable? So this is like a helmet that has, um, you know, the heads up display inside of it. And then faces for performances that are shown on the outside using iPads. So this is a, a different type of mask. And eventually, you know, I'll have some type of avatar that lives here. So I would like to think of like different cases where the iPad acts as a chip, not as a product. Scoot over just a hand. There. Do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. Get ready for the white. What I want to do is bring to market a cool fashion forward concept that educates folks on the importance of uh, recycling, but at the same time creates a commodity around sustainable goods by turning the word ARPET into a brand, EcoCycle. But JT, I want to light the corner, but I don't want it to bleed around the edge. Don't want it to bleed around the edge. <laughs> so EcoCycle, something I came up with and presented to Coke, because what I saw was these ad agencies have relationships with artists and bring artists to brands and brands sit way over there and don't feel they can really connect or artists don't want to mess with the brands. So what I, I was like, you know what, this middleman stuff, cool, ad agencies, you guys are awesome. Marketing companies, fresh. Production house, even more important. I wanted to go straight to the brand and, and make a, I made a deck, create a presentation and pitched it to Coke and now it's real. Got it. Yeah, that's dope.